Soon after backing up your certificate, you need to convert that certificate into an appropriate format which Grid can understand. In order to use Grid resources, you need to convert your .p12 format to .pem format. So this tutorial will help you how to convert your PFX file into Grid understandable format called .pem. Copy your .p12 file into a Linux machine which has OpenSSL installed. OpenSSL is the command which we are going to use for converting your .p12 file into .pem format. This .p12 file will have two keys. One is your public key and we are going to extract that and save it as user.pem. Another one is the private key. We will extract and save it as user key.pem. So here is the command to convert your certificate and extract into a public key format. Open SSL pkcs12 hyphen in input your .p12 file hyphen cl certs hyphen no keys hyphen out and we are going to output public key in the name of user.pem. When I exported my certificate from the browser, I protected it with a password. So I have to enter that password. Mac verification OK. So it means your operation is successful and you can find your public key generated as user.pem. Now the same command with light modification can be used for generating your private key. Say mysert.p12 file. Here I am going to give no certs hyphen out and I want my private key to be named as user key.pem. You need to input your password and map verification is success. Now since this is a private key, you have to protect this with a set of a password. So I am going to enter a password here. Confirm the password. Now your private key has been generated. So now you have two files, user cert and user key. You need to set proper permissions for this file, which you can find from the guide IGCA. So your user cert dot pem is your public key, and user key dot pem is your private key. We have to set proper file permissions so that Globus commands can understand it easily and I am going to set the permission now chmod is the command and I am going to six four four for user sir.pem and set 400 for user key.pem since your private key should be only readable by the user I am setting 400 so now I have to move this file into a folder called .globus. So I am going to create a folder called .globus in my home directory. And after that, move these PEM files into .globus. CD into your .globus. Now you have your certificate ready so that it can be used in the grid. Here is a command grid proxy in it to generate your proxy. So here you have to enter the password that you used while extracting your private key. So your proxy has been generated and grid proxy is the info command which will tell you how long your proxy is valid with few other informations like the subject will say the certificate has been issued to a person called Henry and you can find the time limit my certificate is valid for 12 hours. Thank you.